we're starting to see uh, automotive uh, jobs and the automotive center come back to the city. Uh, and, and Lear has moved its innovation center. Uh, from Southfield into the city of Detroit, just opened. I mean, it's a very exciting time, and uh, it's good to, to have Detroit be at the center of designing uh, the next generation of cars, and uh, we want more and more to go back to the business of making the cars. As you remember how things were six, seven years ago, I mean, does it sometimes amaze you how fast things have changed? You know, it was, I, I remember being here, of course, I was at the medical center, and it was gloomy. I mean, you know, the, the, you just walk and you look at the faces of, of the auto executives. And, uh, and of course, the city of Detroit situation wasn't uh, a whole lot better. But I think uh, anybody who comes down and visits the city, uh, go to a restaurant, walk to the streets, you'll feel a huge sense of optimism. Then you come into the show and see what the uh, auto manufacturers and the, the suppliers are doing. It's, uh, it's remarkable. And this automobility, I mean, it's that the, the uh, self-driving vehicles are going to be on us before we know it. Uh, and Detroit's positioning our self-player role. We just hired a full-time uh, mobility director. That was a job that didn't exist three years ago. Uh, and, uh, you know, Pittsburgh's doing a nice job with Uber. You've got some southern climates that are ahead, and, and I think you'll see Detroit uh, with some partnerships very shortly.